put it simply, it is programs that secretly record what you do on your computer. It exploits a weakness in the host computer and is often given access by the user. Once it's in, it hides itself so the user doesn't know it's there and either passes data back to the spyware owner or takes control of the host computer. Basically, the spyware positions itself in between the web server and web browser where it has access to information. So when a computer, tablet or mobile is infected, details of what you then search for can be seen. Files can be easily accessed, passwords for online bank and email accounts can be copied, Skype calls can be recorded, and your location can even be tracked by GPS. It really is quite creepy. Because spyware uses memory and system resources, the applications running in the background can lead to system crashes or general system instability. Experts largely agree that the technology can be useful, particularly in the criminal investigation area, but there's also a consensus that without regulation, this technology can easily fall into the wrong hands and affect an awful lot of people.